The Monster Within is a song I've wanted to write for a very long time. Most of the music on this album Jacob wrote, and I honestly, I don't know what really possessed him to do this, but he wanted to write something very static X-ish. And um, one of my first metal, hard rock, evil disco influences was Static X. I remember I was on a, on a trip with some friends and a buddy of mine's name's David and we called him Cricket. Cricket was like, you gotta hear this song. And of course, you know, I, I don't even remember if it was on a CD or on a cassette, but you know, put on those little headphones, you know, the foamy things with the wire strap across the top. And you know, he's a loser, she said. And, and it was like, what on earth is getting piped into my earballs? I didn't like metal for a long time. Um, I was more, you know, like Matchbox 20 Collective Soul, Aerosmith, kind of bluesy pop rock kind of stuff. But Static X just got me immediately. And so I, you know, throughout the years had the opportunity to make friends with Ken J. Lacey, their, their drummer, and got to play a couple shows with them over the years. And just Wayne was a huge influence on me vocally and just like the way he did stuff was so different so when he died i think it was in 2014 um it was it was a huge blow i don't really take celebrity deaths all that hard just because i feel like i have a lot of connection with them but wayne static and leslie nielsen are two celebrity deaths that just wrecked me when uh, when jacob brought this song to the table it, it was kind of a no-brainer for me to write it in a style of Static X, very derivative, um, because the song was about Wayne and his, uh, his battle with substances that ultimately took his life. And so it, it was about that, but it was also a memorial for him. And we had the honor and the privilege of having Ken J contribute programming to it. And we had, you know, we've had t-shirts designed, Jacob and our other brother, Reed, um, designed the t-shirt for it and we got Tony Campos's blessing on that. Static X gave us permission to use Wayne's likeness on our t-shirt and um, their thing was, you know, as long as it's respectful, we're cool with it. And I can't think of any way to be more respectful in an avenue like this than to try to honor somebody with artwork and a song. So really, really proud of this one and it definitely it means a lot to me.